If I am not who I am, then who I think is me is not me. But, that begs to question, then, who am I? Who I am, is what I choose to be. What I see and what I believe, is the only thing I can be. This must work if it is what I choose it to be. It is who I became. Scene, a bright afternoon in Athens. Plato, his pupil Aristotle, and a newcomer, Theotetus, are gathered in the shade of an olive tree, engaged in a philosophical discussion. Plato, my dear friends, consider the words of our fellow citizen who is grappling with the concept of identity. They say, if I am not who I am, then who I think is me is not me. It seems to me that they are questioning the nature of their existence. Aristotle, indeed, Master Plato, the question of identity is a complex one. What we believe to be ourselves may be nothing more than a fleeting illusion, shaped by the ever-changing nature of the world around us. Theotetus, but surely, there must be a constant, unchanging element to our identity. If we are not who we think we are, then who are we? Plato, a profound question, Theotetus. Our identity may be shaped by what we experience and believe, but is there a deeper, unchanging essence within us that remains constant? Aristotle, our fellow citizen continues by saying, but then, who I am, is what I choose to be. What I see and what I believe, is the only thing I can be. This suggests that they believe our identity is formed by our choices and beliefs. Theotetus, but can we truly choose our beliefs? Are they not influenced by the world around us and the people we encounter in our lives? Plato, ah, Theotetus, you raise an important point. Our beliefs are indeed influenced by external forces, but perhaps it is our ability to reflect upon them, to question and challenge them, that allows us to shape our own identities. Aristotle, I must agree, Master Plato, it is through the process of examining and questioning our beliefs that we may come to truly know ourselves. Theotetus, so, it seems that our fellow citizens' words carry truth. They say, but then this must work if it is what I choose it to be. It is who I became. If we choose to examine and question our beliefs, we can shape our identity and become the person we desire to be. Plato, well said. Theotet, our identity is not a rigid, predetermined entity, but rather a dynamic, evolving construct. We possess the power to shape it through our choices, beliefs, and our ability to question and reflect upon them. Aristotle. And so, we may conclude that our fellow citizens' words offer us valuable insight into the nature of identity. Though it is influenced by the world around us, it is ultimately shaped by our choices, our beliefs, and our capacity for self-reflection.